Hey guys, today's video is proudly sponsored by Flexi Sport. And with me today, I have the height adjustable Dex E8 and I'm sitting on the BS8 chair. So guys, you've seen some of the amazing functions of this product. The links to the FlexiSport products will be in the description box alongside their website. Please go on there and explore. Start placing your order. It's Flexi time! Hey guys, Hello. welcome back to our YouTube channel. As you all know, this is the Fab Family. My name is Olua Femi Shuoli. And right beside me is my very beautiful, very intelligent, very lovely, very loving, very amazing, very mwah, wife, Abigail. Yeah, so today we want to be talking about um, the things we learned um, getting a car in the UK and driving in the UK, just generally. So this video is more about what we learned than we bought a car, if you get what I mean. So first of all first of all what i always advise is when you get into the uk almost immediately but not long after you get into the uk try to apply for your provisional license even though you might not use it immediately but it serves as a form of identification, identification. yes when they ask for your proof of address you no, can use your no, let me say hold on yes hold on you can use your provisional license um, proof Yo, of address. Please, we are yes. shooting a video. Can you keep quiet? Thank you. Yes, so, let me say proof of address, means of identif identification. You can use your professional license. Then, after you have used about 180 days in the UK, then you can apply for your theory test. Yeah. So, that is still what I always advise. Whether you have a car or not, whether you plan driving anytime soon or not, once it is at least 180 days of you being in the uk please apply for your theory test because if you wait till you buy a car or you are ready to drive before doing all of these things it's going to be in a rush and you're going to spend a lot of money you feel it that you're spending a lot of money but if you do it um timely and um you space it you you might still spend a lot of money but you won't really feel it because you're doing it in bits and it's not in a rush I do not yeah, summary, summary, summary. We have had questions surrounding how we passed our theory tests yeah. the first time. So I'll leave that to Fab Mom. Because I mean she scored higher than, than me. So I mean Well it's just um the grace of God. No, it's not. <laughs> yes, it's the grace of God, but then you have to prepare. So it's just preparation. And I would even say we didn't start preparing on time. Yes. And I think it was so we booked a date and then we were just looking at the dates like this. Until when it was about two weeks to the date. That was when we took it. Yes. Serious, you know. And then getting the right resources as well. We have resources that we use for ourselves. So. And um, it's not public. It's not public. Thing. If you need this, you have to. You have to reach out to us. We have to know you are serious. In, in fact, yes. we have to see proof that you have booked your theory test. Mm -hmm. Then we can give you a resource. This thing is tested and trusted because I even mentioned it to someone. It's not cheat. There's no juru. It's, not cheating. it's completely legal. It's just yeah. I mean preparing tips for preparing. I mentioned it to her and then she scored even way higher. She was really happy. It's just something that works, and we we, we can see that it works. So, yeah. if you need that information, you can just reach out to us. Yes. All right. So, uh, like I said, preparing 
and having the right resource it's just it's they are simple questions yes. actually before we did the um exam people were saying ah sorry i did it five times yes. i did it 25 times kilo shelly oh me too I, I think from the start we felt it was difficult yes. because it's either you know it or you don't, know, you don't it know because it. we did not know it you know but when we started preparing we, we saw that ah, this ah, this question so there's some time. signs we see on the road some information we see on the road that we did not know the meaning but after we started preparing then mm -hmm. we began to understand a lot of things a lot of things so it's just it's simple yes. you don't need to be scared or anything book that test today book it today it's very simple yes. you just read give yourself one week two weeks you pass yes and then don't be in a rush to answer the questions take your time because the questions can be quite um, confusing, yes. but when you prepare the head, you will know that this answer is for this answer. See, I'm looking so far. I'm looking at myself. I'm feeling myself. Sorry, I am. I digress. <laughs> <laughs> so, after you've passed your theory test, then I think almost immediately you can book your practical driving test. Now, the thing, one of the things about booking early is you might not get an early date. It's also depending on location. When I booked my practical driving test, I think the first date I got was about six months away. I didn't even get any dates within six months in Derby where I live. Mm -hmm. I got in another city about six months away. There are also tips on getting an earlier date, earlier you know, which we might decide to share, you know, one on one. That so we use some of those tips and I got an earlier date. You can get a date as early as two weeks, three weeks, a month, two months away. If you are ready, but if you are not ready, you can still pick a date four months, five months, six months away, and you properly prepare for your driving test. Now, the thing with practical driving test is getting an instructor might be really difficult. Ah, that's it's, the problem. It's a job on its own, it's a task. Getting a driving instructor might be difficult. Very difficult. Yes, and I mean, you have to pay. And the money. Yes. Gosh. Averagely about. I 30, think this 35 is why pounds. some people don't even want to start. Yes start this driving thing because the money you pay for yes. for driving classes i mean it's just a lot i know someone who has spent about three three thousand four thousand pounds on driving classes alone i mean so if you set your driving test for three weeks a month two months away and you're spending a lot in a short space of time you really feel it's like spending yes. a lot but if you have your you driving test about it. four months five months six months away and you're still spending a lot but you, you are spacing you're not spending everything at, at the same price at once you know you won't really feel it though you might still spend a lot i know some people who had just three five driving classes they went for their test and they passed it i've heard of someone who has done the practical driving test nine times and failed nine times We've heard stories. I've met some people personally. One time failed, three times, five times. I heard of nine times failed. So imagine you buy a car and you are unable to drive it because you don't have a driver's license and you have to wait till you have. So parking your the car in your house for months without a license is just a waste of time. And your international driver's license has expired. And your international driver's license has expired. So you don't have to wait till you buy a car till you are ready to drive. Just do all these things on time and it will benefit you. Now that, I think that's all about the driving test, practical theory. Now about buying a car. One of the things um, I think we heard or that we knew before we came in was that you can save up for a week or two weeks and buy a car. You can get very you cheap can cars. You can even get to the UK today and buy a car tomorrow. tomorrow. You can get very cheap cars on Facebook Market. You know, Facebook Marketplace. Very cheap cars. Manual cars, 500, 600, 700 pounds. Automatic cars, anywhere from 1,000, 1,200. But I would advise personally that you don't buy from Facebook Market. You buy from any auto dealer. No, you can, if you want to buy from Facebook Market, yes. it's just very risky. You that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I would advise you can. Not, you have to be very. You can, very, but very I would advise. I know some people who have bought cars from Facebook Marketplace and they got very good deals. They got cars that didn't really give them issues and it was cool. And I know some other people that the car really it was like buying problem. You know when you use your money to buy problem. <laughs> Remember that <laughs> <laughs> the car that won't start if the sun does not come out. <laughs> Still, I've never heard of it before in my life. It's when it is sunny that you start the car that the car will start. Oh it now felt like a spiritual problem. Like when it's not sunny, maybe at night or very early in the morning, you start the car, it will not start. 
we had to spend a lot of money to fix that problem. I don't know what the problem was. If it's physical, spiritual. Huh? From Facebook Marketplace. And you can't take the car to the owner that, that you want. I've sold the car, I've sold the car. You've bought the good and the bad. Yeah, the but one. one of the advantages of buying from auto dealers is some of them give you a warranty. Drive the car for one month, for three months. If you have any issues, bring it back, we'll fix it or something. We'll change the car for you. And some people, some auto dealers are also mechanics. They have garage where you can take the car to. So if there's any issues, they will fix it for you. That's one of the advantages of auto dealers. It's traceable and you can easily resolve problems surrounding the car. Also, even with auto, auto dealers, one of the things you should know is the category of the car you are buying. Um, I think it's CAT, C-A-T for short, but it's category. And what that category stands for, if I remember correctly, is some cars were damaged then have been repaired now put on sale so the category tells you if this car has had any previous damage or repairs so if you see cat n there are different categories cat n cat one so i can't remember everything but try to know the category of the, of the car you're buying so uh the car we bought has had a repair something got them damaged and there was a repair so i asked the auto dealer of the history and he showed it to me he showed me the parts that got damaged and it was completely replaced so that was sorted properly for some repairs it will not be replaced or repaired properly you know which might give you other issues so once you see that oh it's, it's the brake or it's the engine or it's something really um technical then you know how to proceed if you still want to buy the car or not so that's why knowing the category of the car you want to buy is really important there was another one another thing is before you buy your car please save up for insurance i also know some people that they bought the car and the insurance company they want to use wants to collect the insurance um for one year at once hmm. some insurance company will ask you to pay will allow you pay monthly but some other insurance company will say you should pay for one year together hmm. so imagine you're buying a car for 800 and the insurance is now higher than even the cost of the car insurance not, is one five insurance is one five. you know because for some of us that use international license to start with you now have to pack the car at home to save up for insurance i mean just have an idea of the kind of insurance you want to do the insurance company you want to use if you are able to do um a monthly payment or a yearly payment with the insurance company so so that your case is not one where you have to buy the car and pack it at home because you don't have money for insurance yet so after buying the car you are doing insurance and you are paying for road tax also the road tax you can start to pay yearly or pay monthly and i think these things are calculated on the kind of car you have the transmission the year and some other factors considered you know so that's it with do insurance have, and road tax do you have any advice on getting a driver a driving an, an instructor no i don't have any advice on instructors sometimes you have to try out a few instructors before you know the one that works for you and sometimes it's depending on recommendation if you have people around who have used some instructors and they can recommend yes. them to you yeah that also help because not only not all instructors are good for you some of them their way of teaching will not be good for you if you get what i mean so you might have to try out a few before you know which one works for you for getting a driving instructor the last one last advice we have for for those that are still back home and want to relocate to the UK, please learn how to drive before coming. Mm. It's easier over there. Like, and cheaper. And cheaper, yes. So, at least you know how to do the basic driving before you can learn the UK standard or anywhere else standard. I think it's easier to just learn it in your own country. You're a perfect driver. Don't be like me. I was very lazy. They taught me, oh, they even taught me manual, they taught me automatic, but I just didn't take it serious then. Now I have to spend a lot and so annoying because it's very expensive. Yeah. So learn how to drive, do it very well. So you just come here and brush up, do a few classes. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so I think with that, if you remember anything else, we can leave that in the comment, in the comment section. section and also please if there's any other tip you can give 
on buying a car driving and all of this stuff in the uk please leave it in the comment section so others we as well as others can learn from it yes with that we've come to the end of this video yep please subscribe like and share our videos yep. we are the fab family youtube channel and for our returning subscribers thank you for always coming back thank you for watching god bless you i feel like we now have a family self here yeah. <laughs> all right guys see you where you see you yes please hold on bye bye it will be <laughs>